Hi, Dan Paladin. Nicole Bouchong here. Bringing you another episode of the Mortgage More So. Uh, Nicole, quick question. Are we still in a very competitive seller's market? Dan, yes, we are. Inventory remains very tight. Well, Nicole, is there anything we can offer buyers and realtors for that matter on how to have their offers stand out from the average one? Dan, that's a great question. The stronger the offer is put together really increases the odds of the offer being accepted. So we suggest going beyond the standard pre-approval process. Great. Can you point out an example of what we do to strengthen an offer? Of course. We take the pre-approval process further than just reviewing the required documents and issuing the pre-approval letter. We run the accurate information with the automated approval system, which is the first step prior to submitting the file to underwriting. I noticed you mentioned accurate information is run through the approval system. Does that to mean that the approval is only as good as the information submitted? And if the information is manipulated, you can end up with false inaccurate findings or decision. Would that be accurate? That is correct, Dan. One other process to strengthen the offer is to submit the borrower into underwriting for the credit approval, which means the underwriter has validated the automated approval and issued a credit approval to the borrower. The borrower only needs to identify a property. That's great information and very helpful. So the takeaway is the stronger the buyer's offer is put together, can increase the odds of having their offer accepted in this very competitive real estate market. That is true, Dan. Super. So if you'd like a strong pre-approval, please reach out to us. We can get that process started and start you on your home ownership journey. And that's it for this episode. And to our realtor and referral partners, remember, remember if you're, if you're working, working, we're working, working and, and we'll, we'll see, see you next time, time on the Mortgage Morsel.